strongly so far this year, and he could certainly be close. Uh, there we're going to take a look at number one hot steam for Brent Grundy. This horse, again, had uh, a lot of time off. Last out in April, he came back and qualified fairly strongly into a one and two. First start back, 154 and two. Good effort by hot steam. The two all systems go New Zealand horse for Mike Lachance. Again, two wins in a row now. This horse is a strange New Zealand horse in that he was raced at the age of two. Most of them don't even start their careers until they're four or five. All systems go looks like a talented horse and uh, it will be tested today, but could have what it takes here in the Invitational. Three scarlet and gold with Eddie Tracy. Huge last half by this horse. Last start to get up for the win. Again, another one moving up in class. Came home in 55 and one. Tremendous effort from off of the pace. Bill Companion taking over the training duties three starts ago. Since then, this horse has had a second and two wins. So he looks to be the sharp one. There is the free-legged pacer, number four, Oscar Road. Again, just no hobbles on him. He's very steady. Uh, Jim, trainer Jim Martin, when he took the hobbles off of this horse, he really seemed to respond. He's got a long stride. He is 9 for 18 so far this year. 50% wins in 18 starts for Oscar Road. Racy Rat, the five horse. Five Racy Rat for Johnny Chapel. Last out from post position number six. Was placed up for second. Suffered interference early on in the Invitational. This horse has been consistent this year with 10 top two finishes already in 16 starts. He is on a real roll. Six Big Bears rolling with Bill Tange Jr. coming off of two wins in a row. Big Bears rolling has said sort of an in and out year so far, although he's been in the money a lot with uh, 10 top three finishes out of 13 starts. Big Bears rolling from this post position today will have to come from off of the pace. I'm not sure that he can do it. It's a little bit tougher post position than he has been drawing so far. And rounding it up as we're almost ready to head to post is number seven, Charmin Looks with Fred Gregory. Second place third. He was the, per the horse that caused interference against Racy Rat last start. But Charmin Looks on his best effort can be a threat. This horse with 22 lifetime wins. He knows where the winner's circle is. Indeed, Charmin Looks, the seven horse. And they're almost ready to go as we're set for the Invitational here in Calgary this afternoon. It is a seven horse field. $8,000 and without further ado, let's go up the track announcer, Murray Slough at Stampede Park. Thank you very much, Roger. Thank you, Roger, and welcome to those watching on CTV Sportsnet. It's time for the Invitational Pace here, race number eight. This starting gate is rolling. And the field swings to the backstretch. It's post time. They're off and pacing. Oscar Road got a jump on them by about a length. And he is driving out quickly for Jerry Houdon. He crosses over well before the eight pole. Oscar Road to the front. On the rail there, Hot Steam is parking out the New Zealander. All systems go as with Lachance looks for the two hole and now gets it. Oscar Road drove on, got all systems go into second. Hot Steam got away third. Scarlet and gold from fourth. Fifth is a Racy Rat, and then a Big Bears Roland and a Charmin Looks. They race single file past the quarter with Oscar Road. A blistering opener, 26 and a three fifth seconds. Racy Rat tips out from fifth for John Chapel. Following him, loving that cover, is a Big Bears Roland. Oscar Road, 26 and three opener. He's got the lead by a length and a half on all systems go. Ranging up on the outside is Racy Rat. He's third. Outside fourth, Big Bear's rolling. Inside fifth is Hot Steam. Then out in the flow, you've got Charmin Looks. And Shuffleback Trailer then is Scarlet and Gold. Half was 56 and three for Oscar Road. And a Racy Rat's coming at him down that backside. 32nd second quarter, Racy Rat trying to clear. Oscar Road who's digging in. Big Bears Roland is loving a second over trip right now. And then locked in fourth is all systems go with Mike Lachance. Racy Rat and neck in front, but Oscar Road fighting back three wide. There goes Big Bears Roland. Three quarters, 124, three fifths seconds, 28 second backside. Racy Rat takes over from Oscar Road, but Big Bears Roland coming on. Slipping out is Mike Lachance with all systems. Systems go. Here they come down the lane in the Invitational. Far outside, Scarlet and Gold kicks into gear. It's Big Bears rolling. Racy Rat, Hot Steam, and Scarlet and Gold gaining. Big Bears rolling, digs in and hangs on just barely over Scarlet and Gold. It's Big Bears rolling. Winning the invite in 153 4 fifths. 53 and 4 for our invite this afternoon. Nice performance by Big Bears.
large on the outside. Uh, Billy just urging him on. Oscar Rhodes pretty much uh, done at this point, although he's such a veteran campaigner. Look at him actually try to come on. And on the outside, number three, Scarlet and Gold making a race out of it late. Look how close he is and just a few strides back after the wire. He looks like he might have gotten up One to the One very happy fella win. here. He started off his day by winning the juvenile diabetes 50-50 draw. I guess he should have had an idea what was going to happen there. Bill, what about Big Bear's rolling first? Big Bear, Big Bear was good today. He got a good trip and uh, what a really impressive ball today. And again, he equaled his lifetime mark. We were saying before we got on the air that you win three invites in a row in Alberta and still pay $11, but we know Travis's horse took some money. It, it was a tough field today, and uh, with the new horse in there and Mike driving him, uh, maybe a little bit of bad luck, but I thought it was a good race. Yeah, no doubt. And what about step back? When did you find out you picked up this mount? Like when I got off the jogger on my last trip about 11 o'clock this afternoon. So it kind of made the day go a little, uh, little swifter. What a nice day. What are you expecting from them in the second heat? Have they got any concerns about qualifying on Tuesday and then having to race two heats? Uh, I really haven't talked to him yet. Uh, I'm dying to get over there to see what they have to say, but uh, he finished quite strongly in his, uh, in his elimination, and uh, I'm just happy that I'm able to drive him. Well, congratulations on your day, and it, uh, I think that was a little bit of a hint you want to get back there. Go get your picture taken. Congratulations. Back to you guys. We showed you these big bears, but he was rolling too. $11 <laughs> to win, $4.30 to place, $3 to show, Scarlet and Gold.